Hi guys, I'm John with uh, Salt Creek Farmstead and uh, we're, we're doing a, a new series. Uh, it's going to be called 12 Days of Prepping. And uh, for the first video we're going to do, we want to keep the, we want to keep everything like under $20. So yeah, they're, they're, the stuff we're doing isn't like the best stuff, but it's just to kind of get your get your brain going and give you ideas for stocking stuffers or things to give to uh, gifts for people at work or, or whatever, or your kids. Um, so we're, we're, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to talk about uh, lights because mo those are going to be the things you're going to use the most. If the lights go out, if you're stranded on the side of the road, if you know anything, I, and I, I use them every single day for my work because I work on appliances and I'm always behind something and the new light bulbs that they have out don't give off enough light at all and so um, what I use at work which is I use this it's, it's a light bar basically for your head it's a headband and these are great they they recharge uh, type C charger and you just uh, charge it so you don't have to keep replacing batteries. I used to have uh, headlamps with AAA batteries and I'd go through batteries at one, once a week and they got pretty expensive. So these work really well for that kind of stuff, for task stuff, for uh, you know reading, doing uh, work on your car under the hood or th anything like that. Now if you're in the woods and you're walking out it doesn't put off enough light to uh, and they don't last very long. Uh, they, this particular one I have in my hand, I bought a four pack for like 20 bucks and it only lasts about three hours, but you can recharge it. So I keep like three of these in my truck so that I can go through them um, and charge them at night. Uh, but these are really cool and it's, uh, I'm going to put it on for you. So it just fits on like this and the light goes all the way across and then you have a spotlight here. And that really, it widens your, your light view so you don't have to hold a flashlight in your mouth. So these are really good. And we'll put the links of everything in there. These are really good for stocking stuffers or if you've got someone that does construction or anything. But it's also good to just throw in your glove box um, in there. Um, and then the, these, this is a nightlight slash flashlight. And this is made by Energizer. We have these all over our house and our bathrooms and stuff. And they plug into the wall, they plug into an outlet, and you can have, there's a setting on there that if the power goes out, they will light up, or you can set it as a night light. And so if you have like a hallway or something like that, you can also grab it. So you get a flat, you can use it as a flashlight if you, if you want to, you know, need to get around your house or something. So these are really good if you're front in areas that have, uh, you're prone to power outages, especially uh, for storms and things like that. And I think we got a two pack of these for $25 or something like this. Um, but these are great for that kind of stocking stuffers too. And we're going to get more into the more of the prepping survival stuff now. So this is just a cheap headlamp with the AAA batteries. I'd recommend something like this if you're going to be hiking and you're going to, uh, you want to further uh, build a vision and, and I like the Energizer ones, but this one's just a cheap gear light, and it really is cheap. It's just plastic, but I think I got a two-pack for like nineteen dollars, um, and they're pretty good. All right, now now we have the next thing I like. I really like this flashlight. I bought one a couple, two a couple of years ago to put in our hunting packs, and uh, the it's a re it's made by Anchor. It's the Anchor Boulder. It's the C90, um, and it's got nine hundred lumen so you can get pretty far out there and it's got an adjustable so you can broaden it or zoom in on the lens there and it's I'm gonna unscrew the top this is this is attached to it so you don't lose the top but it's got a type C so you just plug it in like that and recharge it and if you want to carry extra batteries with you so if you're going on a multi-day thing it's just a regular um the lithium battery i've seen them all over the place but it's a it's pretty good so i've used this for a couple of years now and i can stand on my back 
porch and if and shine this clear probably was we got 150 feet to the chickens from our house and i can check to see i can check on the chickens at night so it's pretty good and it's on black friday um they're usually about 35 dollars but when they're on sale you can get them for about 20 25 dollars so i'm really i like the anchor one i've this is my favorite flashlight i've ever had in my whole life um so and it's it's small enough you can put it in your pocket and this is steel it's it's not plastic this is this is metal um so it's really good and then the last thing we're going to talk about is is uh we always keep these glow sticks and you can get them at the dollar store if you want but they're not the best but these ones will glow for like it says 12 hours of light we tested it and it goes for like 24 hours and this is a six inch glow stick and i got 50 of them for like 20 bucks and i figure i tested it and you get about an, an, a foot of light per inch so if you want a 12 foot light light radius you get it, get the 12 inch ones and the, these are the the green ones um but these are great for putting in your bathrooms having in your cars for if you get to change tires so you can throw them in the road things like that and they're not real expensive um so these are these are really great for to have for your in your kits that's going to conclude this video which is the emergency lighting video we're going to have 11 other videos which obviously the 12 days of prepping is there's going to be 12 videos and it's all going to be geared around small stuff not the big stuff it's going to be stuff that stockings you know 10 20 dollars stuff and uh if you by the end of the 12 days if you buy one of each or you want to put kits together you have a pretty decent kit to uh withstand you know most storms or stranded in your car or something like that or even a day pat even you know overnight you get stranded overnight or something anyways thanks for watching we'll catch you next time